<laughs> Meghan Markle has been making secret visits to victims of the devastating Grenfell Tower Inferno, according to reports. Prince Harry's fiance is said to have been moved to tears after making up to four visits to the Al Manor Mosque in West London. The former actress has opted to make the private meetings without Harry as she gets to grip with royal charity work, the Mirror reports. A leading Grenfell community member told the newspaper, Meghan's visits mean so much to us. The Queen also made a public visit to the mosque, which was opened by Prince Charles in 2001. Chief Executive Abdulrahman Said said Meghan had made three or four royal visits since Harry's trip. The mosque, which is around a mile from the gutted tower block, opened its doors to provide food, water, shelter, and counseling after the fire. Her charity work has echoes of Princess Diana's own volunteering when she met HIV and AIDS sufferers around the world. It comes after royal officials revealed Meghan and Harry will tour the streets in a royal carriage straight after their wedding. A fairy tale procession through Windsor will follow the ceremony at St George's Chapel on May 19, royal officials revealed yesterday. Harry, 33, and Meghan, 36, will wed at noon, avoiding a direct clash with the FA Cup final later. Their fairy tale carriage ride begins at 1 pm, then they will join wedding guests for a reception in the St. George's Hall State Room. Prince Charles will host an evening reception reserved for close friends and family. The Dean of Windsor David Connor will conduct the service and Archbishop of Canterbury Justin Welby will marry the couple. The palace said the pair were very much looking forward to sharing their celebrations with the public. We pay for your stories. Do you have a story for The Sun online news team? Email us at tips at the sun.